Yes, but uh, I think okay, it's I'm at the Martin Luther King Memorial, and there's an organization here called. I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna have you talk about it. Do you mind telling people a little bit about your organization and what you're trying to do? Okay, my my personal organization in Baltimore it, it is is called the War Project. A war is an acronym for willing, able, and ready. That means helping people to be willing to do what they can do to better themselves, empower them, to be able to get jobs, uh, uh, able to do the work, and then they got to be ready to do the work. You know, um, I have a uh, GED program, I have a, a CDL licensing program, um, I, I train people for, uh, uh, um, what is the word I want to say, I, I train people for um, heavy equipment operation, we have backhoes and bobcats, you know, we, we, we partner with uh, different unions, uh, labor unions, so that these people can get jobs because some of the decisions and choices that people made in life, it affects them to the point that they can no longer go out and get the normal job that will pay them the kind of money that uh, uh, they need in order to survive or pay, take care of their family. Talk so about the be me. this is what Be Me is, it, it is encouraging black men to, to, to actually stand up and be who they are. You know, uh, the beautiful thing is, you'd be surprised the passion that the black man has for his community. And, and, and our society has literally erased that and, and, and it makes it seem as though the black man is a threat when in fact, that's not so. We're concerned and we care, you know? So we're just simply taking back what, 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 what the devil, not the government, the devil has stolen from us. You know, Can you talk a little bit about idea. your perspective on Baltimore? My perspective on Baltimore is we need a lot of help. We need help not only from uh, those that are in the city, but we need help from those that are out of the city and out of the country. People need to really, you know, take note of what's really happening because it's a sign that people are frustrated. People are tired. People are just simply fed up with all the rhetoric and promises that are made and aren't kept. So, thank um, you. Thank you. What are, what exactly, what are some of the things that you personally have been doing? That's what I was saying yeah. about... Uh, uh, um, In terms of being involved with the church. Involved with the churches? Uh, involved, I, have, I have 12 churches. Um, the Lord has blessed me to be in Germany, England, and Baltimore. And it's about empowering people to do powerful things. That's what I'm doing. Because I can. Thank you. That's Thank great you. to hear Thanks that while we're at Martin Luther King Memorial. Thank you. God bless you yeah. guys. Somebody wants to know, are you a pastor? Today? I'm Bishop James A. Winslow. You can Google me or you can check me out on Facebook. Just my name. My website is uh, bishopjaw at comcast.net. Thank you so much. Thank you. Spreading the Thank word. You. Thank you. Bye-bye. Yeah, I couldn't come up.